Hello everyone, welcome to my The Young and the Restless Homies official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Young and the Restless rumors suggest that Daniel Romalati Jr. will arrive at Lily Winter's apartment and tease about a surprise he wants to show her on Thursday, October 19. Daniel will win Lily's agreement to move in when he leads her downstairs to an apartment. Daniel will be relieved because he has already signed the paperwork, but he is convinced that he could have persuaded Lily if she had been opposed to the idea. There will be plenty of kissing and flirting as Daniel recommends a special housewarming party for just the two of them later. Phyllis Summers will join Danny Romilotti at a table at the GCAC while he waits for his lunch. Danny will wonder what has gotten into Phyllis because she will be in such a nice mood. Phyllis will say that she scraped the last of a terrible connection off her shoe, but she will refuse to divulge any further details and will press Danny to simply be pleased for her. When Danny's food arrives, Phyllis will request that the waiter place it in a to-go container and offer her an identical order. Soon after, Phyllis will have a picnic with Danny in the park and reveal that their recent chat was quite beneficial to her. Because the past is gone and the future hasn't happened yet, Phyllis will focus on living in the now. When Lily and Daniel arrive, they will inform Danny and Phyllis about Daniel's new apartment in Lily's building. Daniel will note that there is a spare room for Danny, who will inquire if he could use it for an extended stay because he was planning on staying GC'd for a longer period of time than thought. Phyllis will suggest hosting a housewarming party when Daniel says Danny can have the room as soon as it's complete. Daniel is fine with it as long as it isn't tonight. Phyllis, Daniel, Lily, and Danny will instead agree to meet for drinks later. On Thursday's episode of Y and R, Nick Newman will meet with Victoria and Nikki Newman to discuss Victor Newman's mental state. Nick will provide updates on Victor becoming confused about who was in charge of Newman Media and forgetting that Sally Spectra's newborn girl with Adam Newman died. Although Nikki would imply that it could be the normal aging memory loss, she will still appear worried. Nick will now comprehend Victoria's prior warnings and believe they must do whatever it takes to get Victor help. Following that, Nick will chat privately with Victoria, who will sense that something is up with him. Although Nick will confess that his relationship with Sally is finished, he will want to focus on Victor for the time being. When they approach Victor with their concerns, Victoria will propose that they need a cover story, but Nick will believe that they should be honest and face the matter head-on. When Victor finds Adam sitting at a table at Society, he will meet him and tell him about his employment as Nate Hastings' assistant. After Victor urges Adam not to disrespect his intelligence, he'll pretend as if he's caught Adam off guard and rave about all the times he defended his kid in front of everyone. Victor's anger will intensify as he screams that he's done and dismisses Adam on the spot, despite Adam's insistence that he start at the bottom as they discussed. Following that, Adam will appear surprised as Victor seats at a nearby table, and he will be even more perplexed when Victor appears to forget the confrontation ever occurred until Nate arrives. Nate will compliment Adam's efforts, so Victor will act as if this is excellent news and will say that he'll see both of them back at the office. Adam will discreetly inform Nate of the strange behavior he witnessed, but Nate will not be as concerned as Victor's children. Having said that, Nate will hint about going into protective mode when it comes to Victor's well-being, and Adam will believe the same applies to Newman Enterprises. Back at Society, Nikki will sit down with Victor and tell him about the occurrences Nick revealed during their meeting this morning. Victor will claim Nick was puzzled, but Nikki will argue that Nick and Victoria believe he is the one who is confused. After Victor reassures Nikki that she has nothing to worry about, she will inquire whether this has anything to do with Victor's intention to test his children. Nikki will argue that if this is the case, the proposal is simply too cruel. Victor will explain that he is merely looking for the traitor, therefore Nikki will argue that it will be Adam. Victor will remain tight-lipped about how he plans to accomplish his goal. When Nikki finds Adam at work later, he'll inquire whether she's seen anything strange about Victor and voice his concerns. Nikki will question Adam's belief that she would tell him anything, but he will argue that they both care about his father. However, Nikki will not believe Adam actually cares for Victor, and will argue that it is all about what Victor can do for him. After reminding Adam of her previous warning, Nikki will stress that if he tries to damage or undermine Victor, 
she will destroy him. Nikki will fully expect Adam to do so, and she will refuse to stand by and watch him crush Victor's heart. Nick and Victoria will be open about their concerns about Victor's forgetfulness and disorientation in Victor's workplace. Victor will point the finger at Victoria and claim that she has convinced Nick that he is mentally sick as a result of her desire to recapture the throne. Victoria will deny everything, but Victor will not tolerate backstabbing and will evict her and Nick from his office. Adam will overhear the last part and appear uneasy about the entire affair. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Victor's plot may result in some unanticipated complications, so stay tuned. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Adam Newman will unearth a discovery that will make him even more concerned about Victor Newman's well-being. Victor is testing his inner circle in order to find the traitor, but he is terrifying his loved ones in the process, according to Rai and our supporters. Victor's next technique appears to be putting a bunch of drawings on a notebook and making it appear to be an important paper. Victor might tell Adam to send it somewhere essential, or he might just leave it for Adam to locate. Adam will eventually get his hands on this notepad and become even more concerned about Victor's mental health. It will lead to Adam showing Nick Newman the sketches he discovered and pleading with his brother to see Victor's true condition. Adam will suspect Victor is on the verge of a mental breakdown, so he will feel compelled to act quickly. But things will eventually fall into place for Nick. Nick will fit the puzzle pieces together and conclude that Victor is faking his latest problem based on Adam's discovery and any hints Nicky Newman may provide. Because Nick won't be updating Adam on the reality just yet, they'll merely tell his brother to leave it go for the time being. Adam will probably object, but Nick will claim that he can handle this himself and will shortly visit the Newman property. When Nick comes, he will call Victor out for playing games with their emotions. Victor would most likely pretend he has no idea what Nick is talking about, but Nick will warn him that he is on to his father and demand a confession. If Nick is unable to reach Victor at first, Nicky may argue that the game is over. Regardless, Victor may eventually reveal his plan to find the traitor and how it necessitated going to extremes. Nick isn't going to be thrilled once he learns about Victor's twisted ploy, but it's better than the alternative because his father isn't suffering from actual mental decline. Highlights from the young and the restless. Jill was disappointed to find that Victor had sold his Chancellor Winter's stock to Mamie. Given their problematic history, Jill felt Mamie was up to something sinister, especially given how discreet she was about the whole situation. Jill is now digging for dirt on Mammy. Will she discover anything regarding Mammy's activities? Maybe she'll discover the same Tucker link that Phyllis did. According to the young and the restless spoilers, there will be much more Newman turbulence in the future, so stay tuned for updates of the family drama. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.